Today we're going to take a look at uh, how to view membership of our Google email groups via the Google interfaces. Um, also, on if you're the owner slash manager of a said email group, on how to add and remove members. So let's first look at how we get to the management feature of groups. We're actually come up here and we're already logged into our email. We click on groups. It brings up a page that'll give us my groups and browse all. In this case, the first thing we want to do is look at uh, membership of a group. You do not need to be a member of that group in order to view the members of that group. This is so that you can make sure you're getting the right group uh, that you want to send an email to. By clicking on this, it'll give you um, at least uh, in and around about 128 listings to choose from. They are kind of random. Um, the best thing to do is there are more than 128, so if you know the beginning few letters of this, you're going to want to just type it in. In this case, um, we're going to go here and say, look at Administrator 68. We click on it it'll let you know that you are not a member of this and that you pretty much can only look at the list of membership and by clicking on that link it will give you the membership list okay so now we want to actually go back to where we were at just this main page if you were to click on groups we need to now edit membership of a group that we are the owner of so we'll click on my groups here or you can click on my groups here you'll notice that this particular user is only the owner of one group um, and isn't a member of any others if you were a member of this they'd be listed here as well um, you notice this is slightly different than the other screen over here to the right you'll see manage and membership again if you click on members it'll give you the membership list if, but we want to actually ma manage those members right now so we want to go into manage we can either do it from here or from this one here by clicking on this and say we want to get rid of John Luke Picard so we select his name by checking the box come over to actions and say remove from group All right, click remove and voila, John Luke is gone. But we find that, oh gee, we need to bring John Luke back. Uh, the best thing here is we're going to use to add him back is we're going to use the direct add membership, which is the third down in this list. You can either start by putting just his name, or you can just start by putting first few letters of the name, first few letters of the email address it should populate for you pretty well. You just click on John Luke's email here and we'll say add. And done. And we want to double check and make sure that John Luke's a member again so we can either look at members here and John Luke is back or we can look at membership this way as well through manage and all members. Some people might find this a little easier to look at because it'll also give you your email addresses at this point. Um, viewing membership lists and editing them are that easy.